All right, gentlemen, in today's video, how to upgrade your style without buying any new clothing. You ready? Let's do it. Tip number one to level up your style without buying more clothing, go back into your closet and experiment with the clothing that you already have. You've got that pink shirt. You rarely wear it because you're just not so sure, but experiment with color, experiment with different patterns. You guys know I don't wear gray jackets very often, but when I'm wearing the pink, I'm like, I know pink and gray work very well. I wasn't so sure about this pocket square. I probably could have taken this out, maybe gone with something that had a little bit of pink in it. What do you guys think? Yeah, it goes together and this was actually a pretty easy match because I have the pink here in the shirt with the pink matching in the pocket square with a darker pink than with the blue. So this right here, a pretty easy combination. But guys, you gotta build up the courage and you've gotta go out there and experiment. Have fun with color. Have fun with different clothing combinations. Tip number two to level up your style without buying new clothing, find a fragrance that you absolutely love the smell of. So how to do that? Guys, you wanna walk into department stores anytime you're going by a place that sells fragrances and you wanna sample, you wanna try them on. What you're looking for is something that is so delicious, something that you like so much. When you find something, a fragrance that you absolutely love, I'm not talking just a signature scent, I'm talking about a scent that you can't live without. All of a sudden, guess what? Your confidence is gonna go up and your whole image and style is going to elevate as well. The next tip to level up your style without buying new clothing, keep your clothing in its place. So here's how it plays out. You wake up, you get dressed, look at yourself in the mirror, you're looking good, and you go to work, and by midday, what's happened? Your shirt is coming out, guys. You've got the muffin top going off. Your clothing is all over the place. The solution, gentlemen, is the shirt stay. What this does is it connects the bottom of your shirt to the top of your socks, and this keeps your shirt tucked in all day. Now the shirt stays featured in today's video, gentlemen, are brought to you by KKJ, the paid sponsor of today's video. And for over three years, I've been testing and using these products. Absolutely love them for five reasons. Number one, it has to do with quality. So let me show you something. Right here, this is the first pair they just sent me years ago, and I still use these. They still work. Then they actually got a patent on it, and they made it even better. Next up, I love the designs. So that last one, I mean, it was an okay design, but I love how they're bringing in color. Guys, go to their website, look at all the different styles they've got for you. Next up, I love the fact that they're innovating. So I know a lot of you guys, you don't like to wear socks, or you don't have no show socks, or you don't want to connect a shirt stay to your sock. Guys, they've got it so it can actually go around your calf and it's comfortable. So if you want to wear, you know, in the summer, you want to keep your shirt tucked in, but you're not going to wear socks, guess what? They've got you covered. Next up, gents, I love that they've got great customer service. I know the founders, I've talked to them about stories, and KK and J takes care of their customers. And the fifth reason I love them, gentlemen, affordability. It's a great product at a great price. If you haven't been to their website for a while, go check them out because they got new designs, they've got new styles, and they've got suspenders. If you use the discount code down in the description, you're going to get the best deal out there on the internet, guys. Use it or lose it. Again, I'm linking to KK and J down in the description of this video. Guys, check them out. A great company. I'm proud to support them. My next tip, ignore style logic. Break the rules. Now for me, I've got smaller wrists. That says I should go for smaller sized watches. 39 millimeter, 41 millimeter, maybe at the most. This watch right here, 52 millimeters, and I absolutely love it. I wouldn't have expected this look so good on my wrist unless I had tried it, worn it a few times. All of a sudden, I absolutely love this watch. Guys, go out there and try something different. Break some rules. You may find, okay, it's not for me, but you may find something you absolutely love. The next tip for improving your style without buying any new clothing, guys, stand up straight. Roll those shoulders back and stand up properly. So many of you guys are starting to be hunched over. You're looking at your phone all the time and guess what? You are training your neck and the muscles to basically go down. You want to reverse this. You want to go to a gym. You want to look for exercises, speak with a trainer that actually they can work on your back so that actually your shoulders naturally start to go back. I know for me, I've actually bought specific types of chairs that help me sit properly during the day. I try to get up and walk around. Maybe for some of you guys, actually a walking one of those standing desks. Find what works for you, but make sure to actually think about this. Just to roll those shoulders back and stand up straight. The next step, gentlemen, to level up your style without buying new clothes, knowledge. Yes, you want to invest in your own education. Tons of options here on YouTube. Raphael over at the Gentleman's Gazette. We've got Aaron over at Alpha M. Jose over at Teaching Men's Fashion. And don't stop there, gentlemen. There's tons of websites with very detailed information. You've got Brett over at The Art of Manliness, Andy over at Primer Magazine, and my website, Real Men, Real Style, where we've got over 2,000 articles. We've got over 20 free eBooks, a free app, tons of great resources you can use to become more intelligent when it comes to men's style. And guys, if you've 
watched all the videos, you've read all the online articles, then go back to some of the great books. Anything by Alan Flesser of Bernhard Road Sell is a great place to start. The next step to level up your style without buying any new clothes, gentlemen, find an icon that you can imitate. And for me, I like to do a little bit of history, a little bit of research. Michael Jackson, maybe you want to go look at Cary Grant. Maybe you want to go look at, I don't know, F. Scott Fitzgerald. You want to look at Elvis Presley. Find someone that you're like, I like what this guy wore. And he wore this in 1980. He wore this in 1972. He wore this in 1950. And you know what? I think I could actually bring this look to now and it would still look great. Guys, go back, look at your men's style history, find an icon that you can imitate. The next tip to level up your style without buying any new clothes, gentlemen, find your old pair of favorite shoes and let's go ahead and repair them. Let's get them back to looking new. So this pair of boots right here, okay, needs new laces, that's an easy fix. But if you look at the leather, okay, it's lost a bit of its luster. What can we do here? Tons of options. You could possibly just come in and polish it. I know a lot of you guys do not regularly polish your boots or your shoes. You wanna do this because this is gonna protect them. But maybe it needs something a bit more. Maybe you need to apply some mink oil. That's gonna provide a little bit more protection protection, although be careful, it can actually color them, make them a little bit darker, so make sure to test on the tongue. Now, if it's really bad and you're starting to see a little bit of surface damage, maybe some early signs of cracks, you want to use a rejuvenator. This is a special type of cream that's going to deeply penetrate the shoe. It's not going to be able to repair cracks, but it can prevent them from spreading. And don't forget the edge dressing. You want to use this on the side of the sole. It's going to make it nice and dark. The next step to level up your style without buying new clothes, gentlemen, fit. I've talked about it before, it's the first part of my style pyramid. If it doesn't fit you or it can't be adjusted to fit you, do not buy it. So adjusted to fit you, you need to know the name of your tailor. Take everything that matters, anything you're wearing on the outside, we're talking your coats, we're talking your jackets, we're talking your trousers, yes, your jeans, you can take to a tailor to get adjusted. When clothing fits your body, it just looks better. The next tip to level up your style without buying new clothes, change up your hairstyle. Okay, so I normally use this hairbrush right here and I go with a side part. I changed it up today, just simply combed it in a different way. Didn't even change up the product, just simply changed the way I comb my hair. But I could change up the whole look, give it a much smoother look if I went with a paddle brush. Notice the number of bristles, they're a lot closer together, there's about 100 right here. Or I could go with a different type of bristle. All of this changes the different looks that the hair you're gonna get when you comb it. I also could have changed up the product. I could have gone maybe with a pomade. Pomade is gonna give me a lot of hold, but also a lot of shine. The product I have in my hair right now has a lot of hold, but has no shine. Or I could have gone maybe with a wax-based product. Wax-based products are gonna do a great job holding, and they're also gonna make your hair look thicker. They're a little bit harder to wash out though. The next step to level up your style without buying new clothing, take better care of your existing clothing. So one of the worst things I see that guys do is that they overwash their clothing. They use very hard detergents and they wash them way too often. Only wash your clothing when it's dirty. And more expensive clothing, I would recommend that you spot clean and you actually try to wash less. Now when you do wash it, wash it on delicate most of the time and do spot cleaning. Point being, gentlemen, the less you wash your clothing, the longer it's going to last and the better it's going to look. All right, gentlemen, so now I want to hear from you. Let me know down in the comments what you thought of this video. And you guys know I love to recognize my early notification squad. If you like this video, click on that like button. If you're new to Real Men Real Style, make sure to subscribe. Click on that notification bell so you get our latest videos. And if you're wondering what video to watch next, guys, go check out this video, Seven Fashion Mistakes That Style Rookies Make. And I know a lot of you guys are dressing well. You've been dressing well for a while, but I bet you're still making some of these mistakes. Guys, I'm linking to this video down in the description. Now, this was not authorized by KK and J, but I will say to improve your posture, you want to do band exercises like this. And what you're doing is you're working those back muscles and it's going to start to pull you back. But you probably want to invest in some proper bands. But if you're in a pinch, you know, KK and J makes a great product. Again, gents, in all seriousness, this is a great product, great company, proud to support them. Go check them out. I'm linking to them down in the description. That's it, gents. Take care. I'll see you in the next video.